Welcome to Add Gene's Quick Tips. Let us guide you on your journey to guide your pipette. You'll be pipetting a lot throughout your time in the lab. Keeping your hands steady can be challenging. That can lead to poor technique, which can lead to inaccurate measurements and errors, causing your experiments to crash like a tired arm. But we know you're not superhuman. So we have some very useful tips on how to support that pipetting arm. First, remember you can always rest your elbows on the bench if you need to. Just be mindful of what's on the bench so you don't spill or accidentally contaminate reagents. You can also stabilize your pipetting hand with your free hand, holding your pipette hand somewhere comfortable between the wrist and the elbow. Or, Use the back of your free hand to guide your pipette. Adding another point of contact can help to eliminate any wobbles or shakes. While trying these, move your hand around and get comfortable, trying to find the most stable up and down motion as you can. Don't wait until your pipette is noticeably shaking to do this though. Practice beforehand, finding what works best for you and make it a habit. That way, you'll always have a steady hand. You know what else might give you a steady hand? Checking AdGene's YouTube channel, TikTok, and Instagram for more quick tips. AdGene, a better way to share science.